So, this is Stacy, or as the kids of 3E like to call her, Miss Fletcher. This is for all the kids that I teach. If you put your mind to it, you can do anything! And Stacy's off. Off the course and in the water. Come on, Miss Fletcher. There we go. Now she's looking like a woman on a mission. Or maybe Bambi on ice. To stay in the competition, she needs to get round this course as quickly as possible. <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Yeah, those first topple towers have already stopped her in her tracks. Oh. Come on, Stacey. Oh, you can God. do anything if you put your mind to it. Now, I did warn you about that mud, didn't I? OK, can she do any better on the second set? Regroup her thoughts. Prepare to fight again. Here she goes. And no. Uh, those wipeouts are costing her valuable time. She's thinking bad things, children, but she's not saying them out loud. That's determination. Right there. Just a little trot now, around the corner to the sucker punch. 22 boxing gloves. They are all randomly aimed. Nobody's timing them. They just happen when they happen. Good luck, Miss Fletcher. Make up some time now. <laughs> no. Oh! As the clock ticks on, that mud continues then to sap Miss Fletcher's strength. Come on, Stacey, you can do it. Now on BBC One, Charlie Dimmock's Extreme Gardening. <laughs> Nineteen other competitors are waiting in the wings to beat this time. Get a move on, come on. Stacey there, looking full of energy as she approaches the big balls. Look at that enthusiasm. Just like Stacey says, she tells the young children that she teaches, you can do anything... <laughs> ..if you put your mind to it. So our first competitor, Stacey, only manages to get as far as the second big ball. But she's not out of the competition, just loses more precious time by having a little swim to the ladder at the end. Come on, Miss Fletcher. This is the last chance to make your class proud. One swing, land on the ledge, job done. She's done it! She's... No, she hasn't. 